the progression of the Bible. It's from Genesis to Revelation. A lot of people miss it. They teach a lot of different subjects and they 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 kind of talk about it. They just they usually just take pieces of it and don't really put it all together. So you can't really won't be able to get the word of God to work for you without this progression. So you want to stay tuned. The progression is now it's I'm just going to take one verse, but it's all through from Genesis to Revelation. Okay, so the progression is uh, it's I'll just give you one verse, but there's a bunch of them in there about especially in the New Living Translation. Everybody wants to talk about turning to God, but you can't turn to God without this progression. Everybody wants to talk about faith, but you can't do faith and forgiveness and love without this profession. And not just profession, but progression of Scripture. Okay? So in, say, uh, Acts 20 and verse 21, the Lou Living Translation, and uh, if you want to do a good word study on the word turn to God or repentance, take that translation there. It breaks it down really good. And so in uh, Acts 20 and 21, it says that repent. What do you got to do? Repent. That means change your mind. Change your focus. You know, turn away from. And then you can turn to God. So you can't turn to God without repentance. You look at that and study. It's really interesting. It's really good. You talk about getting your prayers to work, man, your faith to work. This progression will do it. You won't have to call everybody in town and have a special prayer line, a special prayer meeting, and a special prayer thing and get 100,000 people to start praying. No. You can do it if you know it's profession and confession and the progression. Okay, so repentance, it says, in Acts 20 and 21, it says repent. Then you can turn to God for the forgiveness of sins and then your faith in Faith in what? Faith in the Word of God will work. Faith in Scriptures will work. Faith in Jesus Christ will work. Faith in uh, getting filled with the Holy Spirit will work. Faith in healing will work. It'll work, but you've got to have the pro- you got to have the progression. Without the progression, you don't get the answer. Why? Because you've got to turn from. It's like saying, "I want to turn right." Well, you've got to quit turning left then. And then turn right. Well, it's the same way with Scripture. Same way with God. I want to turn to God. I want to turn to God. I want to turn to God. Well, that's good, but you've got to turn away or repent from those things and then turn right. If you keep going left, you're never going to get right, okay? So you turn and then you turn to God and then you have forgiveness of sins. You have that cleansing effect and then you can have faith in what? The Word of God in Jesus. And everything else just starts unfolding and, and great things develop in your life that way. You see that? So remember, that's all through the Bible. I don't have time to do a word study with you, but just look up this type of word, repent in, the New Living Translation, and read all those verses. Every one of them says repent, then you can turn to God, then you have forgiveness of sins, then you're healed. I mean, it just keeps, the list just goes on. It's really exciting. Uh, even beyond excitement, it's it's revelation knowledge. It change your life forever. And then the last part is, then you can use your faith. So everybody wants to use their faith, but they don't know anything about repenting. See, pray for me because I need this, that, and this, and that, and this. Would you repent? <laughs> See, repent, turn to God. Then, then you're forgiven. Then you use your faith, and you, it takes faith to repent and faith to do everything. So faith is a connector too. Have a good one.